Raytheon High Energy Laser High Energy Laser Weapon System is a 15 kilowatts class laser weapon system that fires a silent near-infrared beam of light to shoot down a drone or deliver. What's known as a hard kill within the defense realm high energy lasers work on land, in the air, and at sea providing 360-degree coverage to protect bases, airports, stadiums, and other high-value military or civilian assets. HELS can be used as a standalone system or be installed on a variety of platforms. It's based on a combination of combat-ready Raytheon technologies, including a high-energy laser module and a beam control system, he says. HELS beam control system is based on an electro-optical-slash-infrared sensor called a multispectral targeting system. MTS, which has 360-degree azimuth rotations with full hemispherical field of regard. A large aperture maximizes the optical detection range and day-night performance capability for 24-7 operations. Elbit Systems Lanius Elbit Systems has unveiled a small unmanned quadcopter designed to locate, identify, and attack enemy personnel. The Lanius has an autonomous mode for takeoff, navigation, and scouting. Based on a racing quadcopter, the Lanius is highly maneuverable and capable of flying inside buildings. Using the images from its electro-optics and a simultaneous localization and mapping SLAM algorithm, it can gather data to build and update three-dimensional maps of its environment. The Lanius can use Wi-Fi or software to find radio communications. The battery-powered unmanned aerial vehicle UAV has a maximum takeoff weight of 1.25 kilograms, a payload weight of 150 g, an operational speed of up to 72 kilometers per hour when flying outdoors, and an endurance of 7 minutes. Panther KF-51 The KF-51 Panther is fitted with a 130mm rain metal future gun system that consists of a 130mm smoothbore gun and a fully automatic ammunition handling system with 20 ready-to-fire ammunition in two separate loading magazines each containing 10 rounds. Thanks to the automatic loading systems two shots can be fired in less than 3 seconds. Compared to current 120mm systems, the FGS delivers over 50% greater effectiveness at significantly longer ranges of engagement. The FGS can fire kinetic energy KE rounds as well as programmable airburst ammunition and corresponding practice rounds. The second armament includes one 12.7mm coaxial machine mounted to the right of the main armament. Ariansmet UGV the Ariansmet is an acronym of Autonomous and Robotic Systems for Intelligence Off-Road Navigation Small Multi-Purpose Equipment Transport. The Ariansmet was built primarily for supporting infantry operations such as transporting munition and weapons, evacuating the wounded, remote-controlled or autonomous reconnaissance and surveillance, and close combat support. The vehicle has a modularity-driven design to support various missions. The two-ton vehicle is a 6x6 UGV evolved from a 4x4 multipurpose UGV developed the vehicle is armed with a deep neural network. DNN-based Remote Controlled Weapons Station RCWS, which can detect track enemy soldiers, localize the source of gunfire and fire back in the direction of the gunfire coming from. Zuber-class hovercraft 
The Zuber-class landing craft has a cargo area of 400 square meters 4,300 sq feet and a fuel capacity of 56 tons. It can carry three main battle tanks up to 150 tons or 10 armored vehicles with 230 troops up to 131 tons or eight armored personnel carriers of total mass up to 115 tons, or eight amphibious tanks or up to 500 troops with 360 troops in the cargo compartment. At full displacement, the ship is capable of negotiating up to 5 degree gradients on non-equipped shores and 1.6 meter 5 feet 3 inches high vertical walls. The Zuber class remains seaworthy in conditions up to sea state 4. The vessel has a cruising speed of 3040 knots 5674 kilometers per hour 35 to 46 miles per hour. Drone Gun Tactica while drones are still fun and harmless to many, others see them as a privacy threat. The Drone Gun Tactical was made to help keep the increasing number of flying robots in check. It weighs 15 pounds and sends jamming frequencies that cut a drone's video streaming at a range of up to 1,094 yards. The signal also sends the unwanted drone back to its starting point or forces it to land on the spot. And the new drone gun tactical is smaller than previous models, so there's no need to lug around a backpack full of gear. It's currently only available to government agencies, but that could change soon. EATEC OGL the new EATEC on Gun Laser OGL is offered in a standard power mill model. Powered by a single CR123 lithium battery, the OGL offers up to 9 hours of continuous runtime. The all aluminum housing offers extreme durability and its compact size is similar to a standard deck of playing cards. The IR invisible lasers are optically aligned so zeroing is simple and easy. The OGL has a unique sliding lever that controls the beam divergence of the IR illuminator, making adjustments from spot to flood fast and easy. Even under pressure EATEC are currently working on making final refinements and working the OGL through the US Food and Drug Administration's laser requirements. Fail Satis. The Tactical Engagement Analysis Solution is an innovative system providing instructors. With real-time training data on the unit's tactical engagement, including impacts, video feeds, user position and marksmanship statistics, it is implemented for advanced training in real-world environments, including close-quarter battle scenarios. AI algorithms are capable of detecting, recognizing, and analyzing objects precisely, enabling objective and individualized performance assessment. SATIS and Sagittarius Evolution are two immersive solutions that rapidly build proficiency, from individual marksmanship to collective tactical training. Rainmetal Erlikon Millennium Gun The Erlikon Millennium Gun uses a 35mm revolver cannon and is a multi-mission weapon system designed for a wide operational spectrum covering anti-air, surface warfare and fire support, offering multi-role capabilities in one gun mount. The 35mm Millennium Gun, with its unique ahead airburst dimension, is a multi-mission, inner-layer defense system. ILDS capable of defeating anti-ship missiles and aircraft, multiple fast-attack craft, 
jet skis and near shore land targets in littoral and riverine waters. It is also effective against submarine periscopes, offering an ASW capability. With a high rate of fire combined with accurately fused airbursting ammunition, the Millennium Gun provides the necessary capability for ship self-protection in the modern asymmetric warfare environment. IAI Point Blank IAI has unveiled its Point Blank electro-optically guided missile that can be carried in a soldier's backpack the system answers the battlefield requirement to provide tactical units. The missile is hand-launched, operated by a single soldier, and can take off from and land vertically back to the soldier's hand. Point Blank weighs about 15 pounds and is about 3 feet long. The missile can fly at altitudes above 1,500 feet, at a maximum speed of 178 miles per hour, 186 kilometers per hour. Milker M32. The USMC adopted the Milker USA M32A1 rotary multiple grenade launcher MGL in 2012. The history of this weapon goes back to South Africa, where designer Andres Peak was inspired to create it after building the 37mm stopper for the South African police. The A1 version has a shorter barrel and is generally strengthened, allowing it to fire medium-velocity grenades instead of just the low-velocity loadings. This increased its effective range from 375M to 800M as well as allowing larger grenade payloads and increased effectiveness on target. PL-01 Concept The PL-01 shape and surface angles are designed to avoid radar detection. This is further enhanced by the radar-absorbing material used by drones and certain anti-tank missiles the high-tech camouflage system uses modules, which look like cells in a honeycomb to cover the flanks of an armored vehicle. The modules are made of elements that can be cooled or heated up very quickly as well as controlled individually, allowing different patterns to be created. The PL-01 uses the same 120mm rain metal 120LLR L47 caliber length 47 as the CV90120T Ghost. The optimized barrel, use of advanced materials. The recoil buffer system and integrated gun cradle result in reduced weight and lower recoil for use in lighter weight fighting vehicles. It is capable of firing all rain metals 120mm ammunition. <laughs>